Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and um, just a quick reminder for those in the uh, release preview ring and of course this will be an advance notice for those that are moving to 24H2 uh, because it makes big changes to the operating system. Uh, to give you an idea, uh, 23H2 when it when installed didn't change much in my PC. There are a few things that when there's a feature update I have to readjust because the settings have changed or again gone back to default and it uh, didn't happen in 23h2 because it was just a small en enablement package but on 24h2 it does happen uh, my settings a lot of the settings went back to their default so if you are using a PC and have made changes uh, check them out but if you particularly made changes in the privacy uh, side of things and the different options of the privacy, the diagnostics and feedback, for example, and so on, uh, do make sure that you have um, your settings are back or that you uh, the, the settings that you've chosen are still valid and has not changed uh, compared to what you had before. Um, we'll probably do and I think it from time to time it's a good idea to refresh as we have new versions of Windows now uh, going through all the privacy and security settings within Windows explaining them and then you can choose what you believe is the best option for you uh, some people like you know I always leave everything on but I know that a lot of people don't want that so uh, we'll be going through them and at the same time you'll be able to uh, to uh, change them but uh, this is just a first little warning for those that have moved to 24h2 um, there could be changes in the uh, settings for privacy if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching mm -hmm.